hello guys welcome to the civil engineering youtube channel please subscribe our channel for more civil engineering updates so today we are going to discuss uh, the quantity of cement to find the quantity of sand and to find the quantity of coarse aggregate uh, we will take an example of a frame structure and we will find how much uh, quantity of cement has been used how much quantity of sand and how much quantity of coarse aggregate has been used in that frame structure right considering uh, an example uh, this is a, a column the column and the beam is being supported on this column this is a beam right in 3d I'm going to show it in 3d and this is the uh, beam and beam is being supported on the two supports is the one support these are the two columns one is this one one is this one the two columns and this is a beam right in this and we are interested to find the how much cement, how much uh, fine aggregate, and how much coarse aggregate is used in this whole frame structure, right? It's simple, a structure like that. Two columns and one beam is being supported. And we know that the, uh, uh, the from the laboratory that the uh, concrete strength here of 3000 PSI and having ratio of 1, ratio 2, ratio 4, concrete strength has been used and the volume of the Concrete used here is volume of wet concrete used here is volume of wet concrete. Let's take an example that it's used here is 10 cubic meter concrete has been used here, right? So now uh, the first thing we should do to find the uh, quantity of each one, we should first find the volume of the dry concrete. Volume of dry concrete, it's very important step that first we have to use the volume, first we have to find the volume of dry concrete and volume of dry concrete is equal to the 1.54 into the volume of the wet concrete, volume of wet concrete, right? So it will be equal to the 1.54 into 10, so it comes out to be 15.4 cubic meter. Now why we multiply this 1.54 with the wet concrete? is we know that the quantity of concrete here used is in the wet condition right in the wet condition but now to find the quantity of cement to how much bags number of bags of cement has been used there so we should multiply it with a, with a constant factor it it come it uh, goes uh, into the dry concrete that how much dry concrete is used because by addition of water uh, the way uh, the dry concrete becomes uh, come into dense condition so uh, wet concrete volume is always less uh, than the dry concrete that's why we multiply it with a factor of 1.54 so that we get the volume of dry concrete which is more uh, than the volume of wet concrete but uh, this is the reason that why we use because the volume of the wet concrete is less as compared to the dry concrete uh, and we have to find the uh, volume of the uh, quantity of the cement in dry condition quantity of the sand in dry condition how much sand how much coarse aggregate is used right so this was the uh, this was the uh, volume of dry concrete comes out to be 15.4 cubic meter right now uh, we have to sum these three uh, this, this shows the cement and this shows the fine aggregate uh, sand and this shows the coarse aggregate and we have to sum this 1 plus 2 plus 4 it comes out to be uh, 7 right it's very necessary because we will need this further so uh, to find the quantity of cement, right? First, we have to find the cement. Cement, and to find the cement, we have to uh, using the formula that how much ratio of cement is used. One, one ratio cement is used. Dividing it by total number of ratios, say one, say one. Multiplying it with the total volume here. The total volume is fifteen point four cubic meter, right? So when we uh, do that, it comes out to be. 2.2 cubic meter right this is the uh, this amount of cement is used in this uh, frame structure uh, the total volume here is uh, 10 cubic meter and we get out that the cement used in dry condition is 2.2 cubic meter in this frame structure how much number of bags of cement is used number of bags of cement so we have to divide the 2.2 by the 0.0347 because one bag of cement 
a one bag of cement I will write it here one bag of cement is a volume of 0 0.034 seven cubic meter one bag of cement has this amount of the uh, uh, cubic meter uh, cement so uh, we divide the uh, uh, cement volume divided by the one bag of cement so we get the number and we get the number uh, approximately 64 we get it 63 63 number of bags of cement is to be used in this frame structure right which is the 10 cubic meter volume of wet concrete now how to now to know about the sand how much sand is used right sand sand is unknown to us so to find the sand uh, simply we will do the uh, calculation like that by dividing the uh, number of ratio and the same two ratio and dividing it by the whole number seven the whole ratio seven multiplying it with the uh, 15.4 the total volume of the dry concrete so we will get the uh, 4.4 cubic meter this amount of sand is being used in this frame structure in dry condition 4.4 cubic meter is used in this frame structure uh, uh, by knowing the number of uh, mm, how much uh, one big has sand we can get the number of bags similarly like as we do in the as we did in the number of bags in cement number three is how to find the coarse aggregate we can see the crush coarse aggregate how to find its volume simply dividing the ratio of the uh, coarse aggregate is the four and the total ratio is seven multiplying it with the volume dry volume we get the required 8.8 .8 cubic meter coarse aggregate it means that the coarse aggregate is in more quantity because its ratio is more here and then the 4.4 ratio is according to the 2 ratio and then 2.2 .2 is according to the 1 ratio is used here so by adding these three quantities 2.2 2.2, 4.4, we will get the 15.4 cubic meter concrete. It means that the total amount of concrete here used in the uh, dry condition is 15.4, while the individual, um, to find the individual ingredient, we can find by simply, by simply the formula, dividing the individual ratio by this total ratio, multiplying it with the total volume of the concrete. We can get how much cement is used. How much sand is used? Dividing the individual ratio here, dividing by the total ratio, multiplying it with the total volume of the concrete. This amount of sand has been used here. Coarse aggregate similarly, the individual ratio, the total ratio, and multiplying it with the uh, volume of the concrete, we get the this amount of the uh, this amount of the coarse aggregate is used. So adding these three quantities, we will get the total amount of the uh, concrete has been used here. So. Uh, uh, this was all about the how to find the uh, quantity of individual uh, cement sand as well as the coarse aggregate and don't forget uh, to subscribe our channel for more civil engineering updates thank you for watching our video